A man who killed two Swedish nationals in Brussels on Monday night was shot dead by Belgian police. The 45-year-old man, named in Belgian media as Abdus Salem, was shot in a cafe in the Sherbeek neighborhood. The attack, which occurred five kilometers, three miles, from the stadium where Belgium and Sweden were playing to qualify for the Euro 2024 football tournament, gravely injured a third Swedish national. Swedish officials reported that all of the victims were men in their 60s and 70s. The attack started on Monday at 7 p.m. when a man on the Boulevard Ypres north of the city center started firing shots with an automatic weapon. Four gunshots were heard. He recorded himself admitting to the killings shortly after the attack. The Arabic speaking shooter claims in the video that he is fighting for God and claims to have killed Swedish citizens. The suspect was tracked down on Tuesday morning following an overnight manhunt, during which France also stepped up security measures at the Belgian border. He was located after a witness informed the police that he had seen the suspect in a cafe close to his accommodation in Cherbeek, north of Brussels. The suspect was shot in the chest and sent to hospital, where he received intensive care treatment but died. He is believed to be a Tunisian man who was in Belgium illegally after his asylum application was rejected in 2020. Belgian Interior Minister Annelies Verlinden said the automatic weapon found on him was the same as the one used in the attack. Hey, superstars, you've been jamming with Jomo today, where we surf the waves of the latest buzz from the coolest memes to the intriguing stories. If you're here for the digital roller coaster and a dash of pizzazz, give that subscribe button some love. It's your VIP pass to all our adventures. Until our next digital rendezvous, keep it groovy, stay inquisitive, and let those good vibes flow endlessly. Mike, drop. <laughs>